Riyadh, Saudi Arabia's capital city, is steeped in history. And this weekend, we witnessed motor racing history because this one-of-a-kind street circuit played host to the world's first all-electric production car race series, the Jaguar I-Pace E-Trophy. An international mixed gender grid featured 12 drivers prepared to go bumper to bumper in identical Jaguar I-Pace E-Trophy race cars. With a top speed of 200 kilometers per hour, these adapted electric road cars are capable of accelerating from 0 to 100 kilometers an hour in just four and a half seconds. This support series will follow the ABB FIA Formula E Championship around the world and the 21 corners, bumps, twists and turns of this sodden Saudi track played host to a very dramatic season opener. Here come the lights, the first ever Jaguar I-Pace E-Trophy Series race is go! Good start from Evans, Sellers is coming with him, decent start as well from Stefan Radzinski, but Evans immediately comes over, covers the inside line, onto the brakes, into the first corner. Is there going to be any contact? Radzinski goes very, very deep into that corner and he's going to lose out to Alessai. So Alessai makes up a place, does he? He's got the inside line for turn 20 and there's a little bit of a brush between them and somehow Radzinski manages to hold onto the place, but it is Simon Evans who leads in this 23 minute plus one lap race. So Alice Powell has got front, got in front of Bandar Alasai. Oh, this was the move from Alice Powell. Oh, decisive. Came out into turn 18. Job done. Good move. Um, oh, oh, and there's a little bit of a slide for Kaka Bueno. I think Radzinski might have wanted a little look into turn 14. Not really an overtaking opportunity. And as a result, Alice Powell now is right on the back of Stefan Radzinski. But Powell might be going here on Radzinski up the inside, and that's two places gained now for Alice Powell. She's carving her way through the order, started seventh, now up into fifth position in the guest car. Through turn 21, and this now is the penultimate lap of the race. So two laps to go in the Jaguar I Pace E Trophy. These three really getting close. There goes Jimenez up the inside of Sellers. Great move. Jimenez forces his way through into second place. That's the move Radzinski tried to pull earlier, but Jimenez has pulled it off beautifully. Simon Evans now exits towards turn 20. You can hear the applause starting to ripple around the circuit. Simon Evans about to make history by winning the first ever Jaguar I-Pace E-Trophy Series. It's the checker flag and the win for Simon Evans.